And welcome back, everyone. Moving along. Alright, see if I can just run. Ooh, barely. And the first one I'm going to go to is the uh, room where we can undo all those electronic locks. Actually, it would have been smarter just to head the other way. Too late now. Whew. Where's he at? Oh, he's right there. Ah, foolish. Foolish man. Referring to me, not Chris. Chris can't help what he does. Chris cannot help what he does because I control him, obviously. So yeah. Anyway, yeah, we know the whole. Uh, so you turn it on. Yes. Now is this computer gonna cuss me out like before? Damn. Yep. Nothing like a computer cussing you out as soon as you turn it on. John. Password. Aid. Uh. Oops. I didn't mean to hit that button. Gosh darn it, Chris. Okay. John. Password without going too quickly is a. Like how he has to slam his hand down just to hit enter. Uh, B3. Really, Chris, you have to be so mean to the keyboard? <laughs> Fist pump and then a thumbs up, really. Somebody's excited. Okay, B2. Password is mole. What? Whoa, hey, calm down, Chris. Watch the language. How did I get that wrong? Oh, whoops. Let me do that. Mole. There's darn it. I'm getting a little, a little too uh, trigger happy here. There. That should do it. Unless the game changed on me, it is mole. Yeah, I thought so. Yeah, I must have put in like the wrong letter or something before. Ah, Chris, you get... I don't know about you, Chris. Sometimes I just don't know about you. Right. Yes, yeah, quit. Whoa, calm down there, computer. Man, everybody's a little too... Riled up now. It's a bit unnerving. We take the MO disc, I will. And then next we'll head to the power room. Ah, he's gonna have to die. Useless, discard it, yes. Uh, 
I suppose I can go ahead and do this puzzle. Yeah, I can do this puzzle, go into the other room, use the ammo disc, and then go into the save room and get the other one that I got from the mansion. So hey, it all <coughs> it all works out in the end. Take this red herb as well. And the shotty gun shells. Yeah, Chris yeah, since Chris doesn't get the bazooka, I guess he gets more shotgun shells than Jill. Here I was worrying about those deaths that we missed. Never mind, we didn't need them to begin with. I don't think I've ever got <coughs> done this game uh, as Chris and not have an ammo shortage of some kind. Right. So I just push... Unlike Jill's, I just get on the stairs for that matter. No, wait, that ain't gonna work. That ain't gonna work, because then I can't push the box to the right. Really? Come on. This laptop freaking's weak. Come on. Seriously, it's a game from 1997. You load games from like 2005 better than this. So that's the weather where you guys are at. Anything new going on? Everybody happy? Everybody happy? F6, F1, F2, F1. F this. How about that? Because I don't want you guys to sit through this for the whole damn duration. I'll just pause the video. So I'll see you all whenever this thing decides to behave itself. And she has returned, finally. What am I getting stuck on now? Can I get through there? Yes, I can. Oh, wait, never mind. I can just push the box over then. I was leaning a little too close to the mic there, so I'm sorry if I was a little too loud there. I was thinking one is to make people deaf. Okay, now we can push this over this way. Push that forward. Damn it. Come on. What is your issue today there, laptop? Besides the fact that you're a laptop, what is your issue? Alright, got that part done finally. There's an air shaft, I'll enter it, of course I will. Why wouldn't I? zombie I'm gonna kill <laughs> provided I get closer to him not but not too close okay good you should have magnum rounds good and once again I can ignore that one um, yes I can Oh, what, I have to be facing it? Or the camera has to be zoomed in on it? Lame. Let's go two, read that. Alright, we can get out of here now. Got what I wanted. Now we need to head to the power room. Power room. I could actually skip that room where uh, that puzzle is all together, though. Alright, come on. Good night to you, sir. What 
what we got up here? Magnum rounds, I hope? I am correct. Like I said, this game just spoils you in ammo. It's ridiculous. Now granted, if I didn't have safe stays, I'd probably be killing more things than I would have been, or not been. If I didn't have safe states, I would be killing more things because I wouldn't have the ability to restart as easily. Yeah, that's what I meant. That's what I meant. And I'll take this green herb along for now. Because I need enough room for the battery. Did I get the ammo desk? I did. Good. Because I need enough room for the battery. I almost hit the damn load button. Ugh, that would have been bad. And with the amount of time I got left, I might be able to start on Resident Evil. Ugh, you're ugly. But yeah, I might be able to start on Resident Evil 2. Come on. Come here, ugly. Knock off that ugly head of yours. I love this room. that I've gone without getting hit, which is a plus. I can play somewhat fair. Somewhat. I mean, I do have a surplus of herbs, so it would be kind of more or less unfair. But, um, yeah, now that I got the battery, that means that zombie's gone. So now we need to head down to the other side. Actually, we need to go upstairs now to uh, the B2 floor. Oh, yeah, I forgot about you. Come here. Lop your head off. Well, shoot your head off. Ah, yeah, same thing. Oh, hi. Oh, hey, I can just run up. Gersh, if I can get it right. Whew, close. That was too. Really, Chris? Stop getting stuck. It's not cool. Oh, that's right. You're there. Ha! I almost forgot about you. Almost, but not quite. Remembered you at the last second. I think it would have been a lot funnier if I would have jumped from him, though. The only problem is, I knew he was there, so... No bueno for him. Okay, now first... Let's do this little bit here. 
the switch, we push it, I will. And that reveals the last Emo disc. Before we grab that, we'll watch the slideshow again. Because I like pictures. The Tyrant. Okay, that's that done. Then we use that in the room right beside the stairs. Wow, we're actually getting through the labs rather quick. Never mind the fact that I, I am actually skipping one room. That's only because I don't need to go in there, and there's nothing in there that I want to grab. And it's also the same room that it is in Jolson now, so there's nothing different. It's just there's the puzzle there, there's like a clip, an herb, and then the zombie. That's it. Nothing we really need in there. Come on, get in there, Chris. Party rockers in the house tonight. Boom! Monster kill. <laughs> okay. And I know I can't sing. You can shoot me later. You can shoot me later when I am drunk and intoxicated and unable to move. Which will be this Saturday. Well, Friday. One of the two. I haven't figured it out yet. Alright, so we got all the passcodes. So let's go save Jill. Or at least notify Jill that... Oh, hey. We've made it. Do, 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 do. Oh, sometime today, game. Chris, Wesker, he is. I know. Shoot, it doesn't open. Look, Jill. Wait here. I'll save you. Okay, I'll wait. Oh, is that the radio? Or no, that was a glitch. Never mind. And it cut off their voices a little bit there. At first, it's um, Chris is trying to open the door, and then Jill's like, "Chris, is that you?" Oh, Jill. Chris, you're alive! And yeah, it kind of picks up from there. You kind of got the rest of it. Now, we need to head towards where the elevator is. And confront the traitor, Wesker. And whatever else he has planned for us. Go this way, yes. Can I run past him? Yes, oh, but I almost ran into him. Ah, uh, him I might have to kill. I'm not too worried about wasting shells because I'm going to go nab the magnum anyway. Shotgun served us well anyway. I mean, it saved us, or served us rather, for shit, like half the game maybe? Ish, maybe? Okay, magnum rounds, magnum rounds, magnum rounds, magnum rounds. So, I mean, I even missed a couple of magnum rounds. I still got a ridiculous amount. There's a small key we didn't use. More magnums. Where's the magnum itself, or did I not grab it? Now that would be funny. Okay, I was looking for magnum, but I was actually supposed to be looking for cult python. Is that all the magnum rounds? That it is. Forty-eight magnum rounds. I mean, if, if that's not plenty, seriously. I think the grand total you could end up with is around 60, I think. 60, I think, is the the grand scale number you can end up with. Green herb, and where's that rip? Man, we, never mind, I don't need it. 
Although I do need the battery wherever it crawled us to. See, we have a redonkulous amount of herbs too. I think I dodged a little, a few too many enemies really, but that's the only real way I know how to play now. Cause I keep thinking, oh crap, you know, if I use one here, I might screw myself over. There's a switch. Will you press it? Yes. Rebecca, I haven't seen you, you for a bit, sick. Rebecca. I saw you in the garden. I've caught up with you at last. Re what? I'm glad you're all right. Don't go out alone. Yes, sir. Jill. Still sir whoa, whoa, what the hell, Barry? Oh, apparently Barry's alive too. Sweet. Uh, <laughs> that was random. <laughs> But yeah, I guess stars are now finally catching on to the fact that, oh hey, maybe we should uh, stick together. I don't know. I mean, they caught on a little too late, but hey, better late than never, I always say. Now, I'm going to save here, so if it really starts cutting out their voices, I can just reload this and we can watch the scene in full detail. Chris, as my subordinate, you had a wonderful talent. I, I would never work for a company like Umbrella, and Wesker... You were formerly with Umbrella. What... what do you mean? Sin since when have you been an Umbrella agent? And a traitor to the stars? Take out those sunglasses. You're wrong. You're wrong. I was formerly with Umbrella, yes. But now I'm prepared to face anything. Even getting rid of you vigilante stars. Vigilante stars. Now, the worst possible situation has occurred. The failure of the experiment created a virus, a biological weapon, polluting the entire lab. No. No, the worst happened with the tyrant virus. I lost some of my stars and team members because of it. You, you killed them with your own? You killed them with your own? <laughs> what the? Okay, that was actually kind of funny. Um... Hopefully it didn't cut off the rest of it, though. Um, game? Game. Don't do this to me. Alright, see you in a few, folks. Worst happened with a tyrant virus. I lost some of my stars and team members because of you killed them with your own. You killed them with your own. Ah. Uh, I did my best, folks, but basically what uh, Chris says is, you killed them with your own hands, and Rebecca says, Really? Give me my mouse pointer. And then Wesker says, Yeah, like this. And he points his gun at Chris. And then shoots Rebecca. Yep, Rebecca's dead. Ha ha! I mean, doll. And then he starts rambling more about stars this, stars that. I can just skim through this then. Chris, I have something to show you. Now, walk. Now, walk. Pretty much he just gloats at Chris and tells him, you know, walk. So he doesn't deny anything, but you pretty much he pretty much says the same thing he told Jill. Like, oh yes, I'm with Umbrella, or I want them to think I'm with Umbrella. Basically he's pulling everybody's strings. Because he's greedy, evil, and shit like that. And then we get to see Tyrus. Is this? That, that's right. This is the ultimate life form. Tyrant! <laughs> Chris? <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> Wesker, you're pitiful. <laughs> this is your savior? You say this failure is your savior? You, you can make sure yourself whether the tyrant is a failure or not. Sounds like such a bitch. I'm sorry. 
Like compared to later installments, he just sounds like such a whiner. Yeah, yeah. He unleashes the beast with a protruding heart. Boom! Crash! What the hell? Go to hell. Yeah. Sorry, not happening there, guy. He's not a tyrant has anything to say about it. Don't don't come this way! That's what she said. Ooh. Nasty. Okay, well he gave Wesker a good night. Or a good night gesture. Yeah. Not a good yeah. You can't kill me. You can't kill me. Why is my gun unequipped? WTF game. Run away. Fire. Run away. Ooh, close. Uh, Chris, why are you shooting at the tank? Got him. Well, I didn't get him, get him, but I got him as in I shot him. You know what I meant. Uh, good thing I reloaded. Got him. And he's down. That's right, kneel before your master. Looks like the control device for this room. Found a door lock. Found a door lock switch. Okay, that's a weird way to word it, but anyway, whatever. Moving on. Oh, hey, she's alive. Wow. Ha! It seems like this bulletproof jacket is pretty strong. I, I see. How, how about Captain Wesker? He, he is sleeping with the ultimate failure. But I'm... Um, hey, hurry up. I want to get out of here. Here, I thought I was the only one with the dirty mind. Excuse me, Chris. What? What? What, Rebecca? I saw a research file in this lab. It said that a great deal of research on the tyrant virus exists right here. Oh, good. We can we expose. We should blow this place up. Um. We are. No, we should expose the people responsible. We are already into it over our heads. Rebecca, can you do it? Chris. Yes, sir. I'll set off a triggering system for a bomb. Oh, okay. Now we have a chance to escape. See you outside the house. Ah. Ah. Okay, yeah, that was the dumbest plan you guys could have come up with. Destroy any and all incriminating evidence. <laughs> idiots. All of you idiots. Right, and I don't really need to go into the save room. I just need to go find Jill and get out of her. Can I use the analog? No, I can't. I was going to say, if I can use the analog, that would actually make this a lot easier. Cover immediately. Let's go save Jill. Whoops, wrong way. Here we are. Sorry for making you wait. Chris! Oh, 
awkward polygonal hug. But I get the gesture all the same. It's very I nice. I could trust you. Let, let's go. There's no need to stay. Well said. Jill. Jill. Right. Let's get out of her. You coming, Jill? Let's go. Uh, where are you going? Let's get going. Uh, Joe, you do realize there are chimeras outside and you don't have a gun. Okay, well, we just saved her to watch her die again. That's nice. How oh, very, very nice. See you later, dummies. Um, oh. Wait, why did I unequip my gun again? I can just run past him. Um. Chris, really, what the hell, man? Okay, thank you. I was gonna say, uh, Chris, go through the door before the zombie gets us. You can do that, right? Let's get going. Can you go through the item box? <laughs> eh, I don't care. The ladder, will you climb it? Yes. One moment, Brad, and we'll get you your sign. Can we get a longer timer than, you know, three minutes? Did somebody just say three minutes? If anybody gets that reference, I will give you a golden nugget somehow. Not just a golden nugget. The golden nugget. But no, seriously, if anybody gets that, I will freaking laugh and be impressed at the same time. Here comes Brad. Do a save. Yeah, I can't really figure out. I mean, I know where the bug's coming from. It's coming from PSX when Bandicam is turned on. Um, I don't remember it happening with Hypercam, but I don't quite understand why it was happening. Because I mean, I tweaked with the settings as much as I could, and nothing seemed to fix it. It seemed like the save itself was just prone to screwing up. Well, thankfully, it only happened in that one particular area. Alright, Tyrant. Let's do this. 
away, run away. That was stupid. Ooh. Yeah, I figured he would throw me on caution. Ooh, almost got me. Uh, Chris, really, what are you shooting at? I swear, this guy's kind of a bit of a bug on him. Ooh! Damn. Run away! Boom, bitch! No, really, Chris, what are you shooting at? Ow! Oh, crap, oh, crap! Run! Alright, hold on, save! Oh crap. He's a charging his laser! Oh, he almost got me again. Oh shit. Hey Brad, how about dropping that rocket launcher? Thank you. Alright, Chris, we got this. Oh, lordy. I will, but I'm probably going to get knocked off my ass here in a bit. Or not. Good night, sucker. Mouth still moving, is it? Yep, mouth still moving. Team Tyrant's blasting off again. Oh, that's that done. Sounds really getting choppy there. Boom, it goes. Yep, we all made it. Perfect ending.
I got it to work as best as I could. Eesh. Oh. Oh. Ho oh ho. Look at that. Under three hours both times. Wow. Just wow. I'm impressed. What a tough guy. Close this case completely. Hoorah! Wow, I did impressively well. I got under three hours both times. Um, of course, I got the rocket launcher now. Um, since the, you know I've got the Let's Play done and everything, um, why not? Uh, let's configure this sucker, shall we? Configuration, memory card. If I can find the folder. Um, records. You can see all the junk that I have on my laptop. Cards. Is there supposed to be like a file or something? <clears throat> Screenshots, no. That ain't good if I have nothing to configure it with. Or actually, yeah, I can use that one, I think. Um, yeah. No, no, it's the top one. Apply, okay. Let's try it again. Okay, well, let me recenter the game. Yeah, yeah. Checking memory cards. Format this memory card. Oh yeah, I still got the sound muted. <laughs> right, let me unmute that. Do it, it doing it right this or do it right this time. God damn. Ugh, can't freaking speak. No, I did it wrong, see? It's not a primary sound driver. Oh wait, no, I know it's wrong. Ah, never mind. I know it's wrong. I turned my. Hold on. There we go. Skip through all this. New game. Oh wait, whoops. No. Ah. Well, now it's really bugging out on us. Oh, there you go, rocket fire. <sighs> oh, I can unlimited Chris saves. Do not save. Yeah, I would have need to have configured a memory card anyway for. Um... Yeah, there's that glitch I was talking about. But yeah, I would have needed to have configured a memory card in order to do the um... let's play of Resident Evil 2 because you need to have one save in order to continue. You have to have the A and the B, I believe. Or, pfft, wrong. You need the A. You need to play the A in order to get the B. Let's skim through all this. Don't know what happened. Don't know what happened. Barry, where's Barry? Well, I'm sorry, but he's probably. No. No. Is that? I'll go and check. Okay, Jill and I will stay in the hall in case of emergency. Chris. Chris. Take care. Hey, air. Now. <laughs> Rocket launcher. All right, let's go have fun with it for a bit, shall we? A little extra scene. Actually, I can pretty much split this video as the second half. Ha ha! So happy. I got a rocket launcher. Let me go show it to my friend. Hey, you! I got rocket launcher. You know what? Die! <laughs> all right, folks. Um, I will see you all for Resident Evil 2. So it's been Chris, Jill, Barry, and Chris face palming. Uh, Rebecca. Yeah, and Wesker, Tyrant, etc. Anyway, yeah. Well, uh, <clears throat> excuse me. 
Well, this has been Resident Evil Director's Cut. This has been Chris with a rocket launcher. So I shall see you all soon.